Hey. hey you guys hey you guys come on in here so i told y'all i was gonna go do a food field trip but it would be local today so i'm at dynasty chinese food don't get me wrong i mean don't don't quote me on that <laughs> but I used to come here years ago when I first moved to Colleen. This place is here in Temple. I used to come here, me and my kids used to come and they used to have like all you can eat crab legs. I noticed those wasn't on the buffet unless I didn't miss, unless I missed them. <coughs> I can't talk. I'm so hungry, I'm trying to eat. <laughs> so y'all, I got some, look, I got to set up my props. Hold on a minute. I don't know why I always come and I don't never have my little, um, my little stand it's always in the car so i got some beef broccoli and some chicken i got my wonton soup i had to get my egg rolls hello it's going good can i get you anything else no not right now it's good to go thank you i love when they always be trying to help me <laughs> I got some jalapeno chicken. Y'all know I like it spicy. <laughs> got my egg rolls. And I also got my, I keep forgetting what these are called, but I like them. Dumplings. Pork dumplings. So I got my pork dumplings. Hey, Allison. How you doing? Yoda. Celebrating. Yeah. Don't do it without me. We got it. We're going to do it together. I mean, I know you're already doing your celebration, but I want us to go out and do something. I love these things. You know you fat when you dance for food. Mm -hmm. <laughs> and that's pretty happy and thick. Mm -hmm. Don't get it twisted. Hey, take them bands off. You know, I can't eat with them. This food is still good. I've been trying to make it here all day long since I did the event earlier today. Stopped by Ross and went to Marshall's. You know, that's like, oh. I haven't been, I, I've come in the curbside, you know, when they were, they were closed during the, well, the buffet was closed during the pandemic, but I was doing um, curbside. But I, I hadn't been here in a while to even get curbside, so I was like, let me go and get me some uh, Chinese food today. I'm so glad I did. Mm. I always I always get this jalapeno chicken. Y'all know I'm be pronouncing jalapeno, right? But y'all know what I'm talking about. And then I got the shrimp fried rice. Mm, 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 mm. Mm. What y'all cook today? Or what did y'all eat today? Mm. Man, broccoli is good. I like when the broccoli be like that. When it's soft, it ain't mushy, it's just right. Mm. Save me a corner. Save me a corner of that lasagna. You know what? I haven't made that. You just gave me, just gave me an idea. Thank you. I have made that on there. Hmm. I gotta do that thing here. Yeah, I have made a lasagna. That that is a good thing to make. Hey, Pam. Mm, 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 mm. Now, don't say that, and I show up tomorrow to get that corner. Cause I'm trying to think what I got planned tomorrow. Nothing. <laughs> I'll be over there to get that corn, I'm telling you. It is good. <laughs> Very good. Gotta get my wonton. Why does this always remind me of like a chicken and dumpling like with a 
Chinese spin on it. But that's why I always get wonton soup. Because it kind of reminds me of chicken and dumplings. If I get any, I don't like the egg drop soup. Because it's got eggs and I don't know. I'm funny about eggs. Mm, 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 mm. Oh, okay. All right. Ding dong. <laughs> and we'll pull up. Y'all know what I did not get? And I, I love it. It's some duck sauce for my egg rolls. If that little guy come again, I'm gonna ask him. I'm gonna be like, can you give me some um some duck sauce? <laughs> Probably not, but I'm gonna ask him anyway. I don't want to leave my food. Y'all going to watch my food if I go to the bar and get some. Oh, I'm going to get some. You know, that's like the dessert. I'm, I'm going to definitely get some crab goons. You know, that's like a dessert to me. Y'all going to watch my food if you want to go give me no duck sauce. Who going who gonna, who gonna to watch my food? <laughs> This shrimp fried rice right? is on, on point too. Mmm. Let me try my egg roll. Mmm, 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 mmm. Mmm, mmm, mmm. Everything is so fresh. You can't even watch your. Hmm? No. Thank you. If he, if he, I'm gonna ask him when he comes. If you tell me now, then I'm gonna get to the watch my food for me. I'm even, but I didn't even see. I seen the lemon sauce. I'm doing good. You gotta get you anything else? Yeah, I have like duck sauce. Is uh, it on the buffet? I think we do, but I can, I, I can, I can go check for you real quick. All right. Thank you. He might bring me some duck sauce. I'll be going there for my egg roll. I didn't see it though. I might have just missed it. You know, you get a buffet, your eyes be all big, you see everything, honey. But what you need, I just probably missed it. But I did see, I did see the sweet and sour sauce, and I did see the lemon something sauce. I ain't never had the lemon sauce, but I, I always like the duck sauce. So maybe he'll bring me some. Let's, let us pray that he bring me some. <laughs> if we do, I'm a chip in. I'm always gonna chip him anyway, but I'm <laughs> giving a little extra. That's your heart. Thank you. <laughs> you got my duck sauce. <laughs> Yeah, it's about to be on. Mm-hmm. Got my own personal duck sauce, baby. Mm. Mm-hmm. 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 Mm -hmm. Baby. The duck sauce is like the icing on a cake. Do y'all like putting stuff on y'all egg roll? What do y'all put on y'all egg roll? Yo, you just put, do you put soy sauce or? Do you just eat it plain? I gotta have me some duck sauce. Mm. Growing up, we didn't eat Chinese food. I didn't know nothing about this at all. So it's just for me to get grown and on my own, right? <laughs> And I never forget when I would eat, went to go eat some, and they were asking me, "Do you want some duck sauce in your, you know, get it to go?" And I was like, "Duck sauce? Oh, I'll pass on that." <laughs> I didn't know. One, so one time after that, they put some in my in my plate to go or in my bag to go, and I said, "Well, let me just try it out." So you know how you do a little sample? She opened it up. Oh. We'll put it on the egg roll. Uh -uh. Been in love with it ever since. 
Now what I don't, what I won't do is eat the, um, I think they got one like a spicy mustard. As much as I'm spicy. They probably do taste good on something. I just ain't figured out what yet. I don't think I've even ventured out to try to see what it, what it would taste good on. Mm, mm, mm. Yo. So I really want to do like um. I like doing brunch. I was thinking about doing a brunch tomorrow. So what do y'all think? Y'all think I should do brunch tomorrow? About 12.30ish. And if y'all think I should do brunch tomorrow about 12.30ish. What y'all think I should cook? Don't say nothing like, well, let me see what y'all say. And then I'm going to go from there. Because <laughs> y'all got to remember, it's just me unless y'all going to pull up. You don't like the duck sauce? Mm. I love it. The sweet and sour sauce is kind of too sweet. But the duck sauce is right on point. Cabbage. Cabbage for the um, brunch? No, I'm, I'm going to make cabbage, but I think it's going to be for my alive probably next Thursday. Fam, I know I'm, I know I got to pick my groceries up tomorrow, but I'm talking about like for just brunch tomorrow, like brunch breakfast stuff. Oh, the spicy sauce. You eat it on cabbage. Oh. Okay. Allison, you missed the appreciation dinner, uh, appreciation brunch last week. I made chicken and waffles last Saturday. Or was it Sunday? Hmm. I think it was Saturday. Well, the berry sauce. I can see that. I can see that. And them waffles are going. Oh! They was going. And I was going in on them. <laughs> what kind of berry sauce? Oh, that's why you want me to make them, uh, you want me to make them waffles again? I'll just see it on the replay. <laughs> Ooh, Allison, they were so good, too. Okay. Pancakes, okay. Hey, uh, Dylan, you got A3. Yeah, I know I've been making a drink, too, with it. Mm, maybe some mimosas. Mm -mm. Maybe a drink made with some, um, with a uh, Moscato. Mm. A breakfast drink with a, made with some Moscato. Mm. I'm going to get turned up and be tipsy. French toast. I got stuff to make French toast. That's Candace's favorite thing. I told her how to make it. Okay. Strawberries, blackberry, raspberries. Okay. Y'all give me some idea. I don't know now what I'm gonna make, but I'm gonna make something. Cause I, I love doing a uh, brunch. I'm not big on breakfast, but I can I can so do a brunch. Mm -hmm. Pam, what you cook today? Y'all, this food is so good. I ate, um, because I was, had to go to my event today, so for breakfast, I don't eat breakfast, but I had some donut holes and water. Pork and beans. All right. I ain't had pork and beans in years. I think it's, it's growing up. Between growing up and my kids, whoo, it wore me out with them pork and beans. Oh, yeah. 
It was quick. And I bet it was good too. I just had I just haven't had it. Had pork and beans in years. Many, many years. I'm trying to think. My kids was proud. I know they was. My daughter might have been a teenager. And Cameron wasn't. My son. Probably when they was like 10 and 13. I think that's about the last time I remember. And I made it for them. We used to eat growing up pork and beans, spaghettios, ravioli, raviola, ravioli. <laughs> I'm bet she fat she was full. That, that's a good old knock you out meal. You said um, pork and beans, sausage and rice. Oh yeah, that stick to your ribs too. That stick to your ribs. Now I got all this food. Mm -mm. I ain't gonna make it. But it's good. I don't never get my money working when I come to the buffet. <laughs> but it's alright. I get to get my different choices. This is what I got on the table. Oh, that's gonna get eight. Mm -hmm. But I won't be making another trip though. I gotta have, but I'm gonna get my crab lagoon. They won't let you get a to-go box when you eat at the uh, buffet. Mm -mm. Nope. They did, but I don't eat crawfish unless it's already. Um, you know, I I can't go through all that work. That's too much work for that. Mm -mm. I mean, I ain't be, no, I ain't gonna be able to do it. <laughs> Mm -mm. They got it. Yeah, it's buffet. It had been closed. This has been closed. Well, I know the buffet had been closed because of COVID. And it's been back open for a little while, but I still, you know, kind of wait till everything kind of, you know, COVID is still rampant. But today it was just, I just had to have it. So, you know, y'all see my mama. Y'all let her know that I have my mask on, though, right? Because I did before I started eating. Just, just you know, put them in the car and just ride out here. <laughs> she don't like it? You don't like being, you don't like coming to Dynasty? Man, I'm telling you, when I'm... When I first moved to Colleen, me and the kids would come, I know, probably twice a month for that when they had the all you can eat uh crab legs. I know wow. It was twice a month. Mmm. It you right, fam, it is ramping up. That's why I said I had to be, you know, kinda, you know, pick my time I wanted to come. It's not that crowded. They asked me if I wanted a table or a booth. Y'all know I'd be wanting a booth. So I can do my my live because the tables was out in the middle and there's a lot of people out there. I'm like back here in the back, like yeah, I don't care. Put me right back here. People probably think I'm talking to myself. Oh well. I really do like these. They make these at H E B too. Now I don't eat the sushi they make. Mm -mm. I don't eat no sushi, but I like these little popsicle things. Oh, they be good. Look, I dipped that in the uh, duck sauce, and I meant to dip that in my, uh, in this little sauce that they make. But it's all right. Let me see what it tastes like. Hmm. Okay. As they should. That was another little Chinese food, too. I got a whole walk at home. <clears throat> and I make, sometimes I make like chicken or beef broccoli or, you know, like this jalapeno chicken. This is real easy for me to make at home. But I wasn't feeling it today. Plus, I, if I try to make all this stuff, ooh, you can't, man. But I could have made it probably because I just would have need like one chicken breast, some broccoli. I could have made it. I was just being lazy. <laughs> I was being lazy. 
Mm -mm. Okay, so I got to decide between waffles, French toast, and pancakes. Okay. I'm going to come up with something. <laughs> I had a event at work, a bulk event. Where people come and drop off stuff. And I think everybody and their mama must have bought them a new mattress set. Because everybody that came was either bringing box springs or a mattress set. How's everything going? It's going wonderful. Can I get you anything else? Can I have some, just a, a glass of ice? Cause it's like my feet kind of getting yeah, kind of yeah. warm. Thank you. <clears throat> he is so nice. Bless his heart. You're in public works, girl. And then I think it's that same place that you had um that you had went to uh, on an interview for. And I had tried to reach out to you before in the city of Belton. But you never did answer the uh, the text. You was on vacation though. Thank you. Yes, girl. Belton. I was on vacation and uh, it was on Indeed. And I was like, I think this is the one that Allison was telling me about. And I sent you a text and I didn't think I would hear from him. For admin assist, uh, admin assistant position. Got my ice. I gotta have a lot of ice on my. No, it's not every Saturday. It's every two months on a Saturday. Girl, I can. You know I can do no every Saturday. Devil, it's a lot. Mm mm. I don't come out no. I don't come out no. Uh, I don't know retirement to work no body job every Saturday. I got some stories I could tell you about it, Allison, but I can't do it on live. Some people be following me on <laughs> Some people at the job be following me, so I can't I have to tell you <laughs> offline. <laughs> I have to go over there in the group and tell y'all. Well, no, I think somebody in the group, too. Dang. Well, I just go to my regular Facebook page. <laughs> hmm. It's too funny. Okay, okay. Here's too funny. Mm -mm -mm -mm. What do y'all have planned? Well, I know you're making a lasagna. You have probably have leftovers from that because lasagna make a whole lot. But Pam, what are you cooking tomorrow? Do you have you planned it out what you're gonna cook tomorrow? I'm not gonna cook tomorrow size that brunch. That brunch should be it. I, I, when I make like when I make a brunch and then it's that time of day, I end up eating like I'll eat it with you guys on live and then um if I have any left then I'll eat that for dinner. That's what I did with the chicken and waffle. I made me two more waffles and ate the rest of the chicken because I only made five chicken wings that day. Yep. You making a buffet? You making a buffet of smorgasbord tomorrow? <laughs> Man, that sounds good. That sounds so good. Are you barbecuing the ribs or are you are you cooking them in the oven? Smothering them in the oven. Okay. 
Yes, I love cooking stuff in the crock pot. It's still kind of, mm, it's here it's the weather starting to get cool, but some, you know, it's still warming up to about 85, 87. I can't, I'm not gonna complain because we had them 100 plus days or, you know, close to 100 plus days. So, but I'm all, I'm always about trying to, you know, cook stuff either in a crock pot, my crock pot, my air fryer, or, you know, cook on top of the stove if I possibly can. Plus, it's, you know, you can cook by itself, put all your seasons off in it, and let it do its own thing. Mm, mm, mm. Okay, that's, that's about what it is here, but I think today the high was, I'm really being about 85, 87. It started out with an overcast. I thought it was going to pour down rain, and I was like, yes. It didn't. But it wasn't bad. That not too many people came, but I'm telling you, I think everybody bought a new mattress set. I think everybody did. Look, so Alice, I'm, I can say this on, on here. So when they when I went on the interview and I asked the question, like, you know, what's a typical day, you know, in the uh, in the in the office or whatever. And so the lady who's my boss, she was telling me. And when she got to the part about the the bulk events and the, uh, every you know every two months, and then she was talking about the Fourth of July, and I said, "Mm-hmm, just the one that I was so telling me about." I um I applied like July the 12th. They interviewed me on July the 23rd, and I started August the second. And I did. I was like, when I applied, I was like, I think this is it. But it didn't say that in the um, the announcement. I mean, in the job, yeah, the job announcement. But when I went on interview and I was asking about, you know, about that's when it became. I was like, hmm, it's not bad. It was from 9 a.m. to one on on Saturday. We're gonna do the next one until December the fourth. So, it's all right. My last little egg roll. <laughs> Said I could not. I understand. You got you got your babies. You got your husband. You... Yes, yes. It tastes, yep, exactly. You got you got your you got your family. So you know, I ain't, I ain't got no ties. You know, I got no my children grown gone. No spouse, no. So I have you guys, and I appreciate it. And my family. I bet I know who it is too. But I got a backstory for that. And when I see you, I'll tell you about it. But I had to get them all the way right. Yep. When I thought I was on, so they didn't. They didn't bring. She. They never said that when I was there. At the at the interview. But I, I know why though. <laughs> I share it with you. <clears throat> Maybe for the front low guys, but that's because they don't. They don't pick up their trash. Waste management is a contractor to do, do their. I know exactly who it was. You ain't eating up. I'm going to call you later. So call around like 15 minutes. <laughs> I know exactly. Called out about 15 minutes. We're gonna we're gonna talk about it. Cause I, I know. But they don't pick up the trash. 
All right, all right. I see you then. Before I go, let me. I'm gonna get on off of here. This is Pam and Be Fit for You. We're on a food field trip at Dynasty Chinese Food Restaurant. It's been good. Came for a buffet. All right. And be fit for you spiritually. Be fit for you emotionally. Be fit for you physically. And be fit for you definitely financially. Thank y'all for joining me. Love you guys. Talk to y'all later. Bye-bye.